What is good everybody on YouTube? It is your boy Forrest Rippertson back at it again with another video. Yeah. And today y'all, you know what I'm saying? I know y'all probably tired of me wearing this shirt. I don't care. It's like my favorite shirt, but whatever. You know what I'm saying? I need a little bit of haircut or something. She ain't looking a little sweet, whatever. But yeah, y'all, um, I, if y'all watched my last video, y'all know I got a uh somebody bought this joint. And yesterday I couldn't do this um because it was Labor Day or whatever. So the uh post office was closed. So today I'm about to go ship this joint out. So I decided, you know what I'm saying, I'd take y'all with me and just show y'all the process when like people buy stuff from me and then you know what I'm saying whatever else presents itself on this journey, you know what I'm saying? Of course, I'm taking y'all with me, so whatever. And we got the skateboard, so we gonna skateboard to the library and all that there. I haven't been on my skateboard in a long time. But yeah, you know what I'm saying? That's what we about to do today, so let's get it. All right, y'all, so when I tell you I haven't been on my skateboard in like forever, I really haven't been on my skateboard in like 100 million years. Ew. I just stepped in that gooey shit. What the fuck? Ugh. Now I gotta get on my skateboard with that, bro. Look at this. I don't know if y'all can see that shit, but it's like some gooey gummy bears. They melting and shit, and I just stepped in it. Fuck. And the whole bottom of my shoe about to be sticky as hell. Fuck, man. Look, it's like chocolate and shit on the ground. People around here just don't care, bro. But yeah, like I was saying, I haven't been on my skateboard in forever. So we about to test this out. I might suck. Well, I know I suck, but I'm not. I'm not trash. Feel a little bit good, you know what I'm saying? Ugh. All right, y'all, so I told y'all I want to see if I'm not rusty or not, if I still suck. So y'all see this curb right here? I'm going to see if I can ollie up it. I don't know if I'm still good at the ollie, you know what I'm saying? I ain't did it in a long time. But I'm going to see. I'm going to see what I can do. Let me put my foot back down. Let me see what I can do. Hold up, one more try. Ah, I told y'all I suck. I'm gonna try it one more time. Just one time for the one time. Oh yeah! Y'all saw I barely did it, but let's keep this ball rolling, y'all. Let's finish. Cause I don't wanna be too sweaty before I get to the library, so. I'm saying, I'm about to just finish like cruise ride and shit, so let's just finish that off. All right, so in this journey, I'm not at the library yet, but I just wanted to like show y'all my walking path and all that. So when I'm skateboard or walking or whatever, I can skateboard or walk for a while. And then I come to like a hill or something like that. I come to this hill right here. This joint right here, hold on, I'm gonna show y'all. I come to this hill right here that I gotta walk up. So I can't skateboard up this. And it's a long hill, especially when it's hot. I just be so high, be like, <sighs> so I gotta walk up this hill right here, then go down the hill, and then I gotta walk up another hill, and then I'm kind of on smooth, you know what I'm saying, smooth sailing after that. So I gotta walk up this hill. Oh yeah, so I get at the top of this hill. You know what I'm saying it's not that big of a hill, but when I get at the top of this hill, then I can just get on my skateboard and ride down this one. Hopefully I don't get hit by no car. But now I gotta walk up this hill. So let's walk up this one. And it's the last one I gotta walk up. And I'm saying, then I'll be straight. All right, so I made it to the top of this hill. And it's the last hill I gotta walk up. And then for the rest, I could just like skateboard on a straight, a little like, kind of curved, but more so like a straight line. And then I get to go down the hill and I'll be at the library, so I'll see y'all when I get to the library. <laughs> Alright y'all, so we at the library right here. We about to go in, so y'all gotta be real quiet. Cause you can't be loud in the library. We about to go in here, we about to take care of this business. Eat it. <clears throat> All 
Ah, right, yeah. So we are out the library, and we are about to go to the um, post office. Bright as hell. We about to go to the post office. Um, hold on. We about to go to the post office. I print out the shipping label. So let's head up today. I had to fill out a few uh, job applications for the New York thing. Uh, y'all already know how that go. We can talk about that again. You know what I'm saying? Cause that's still like a. I gotta talk to y'all about that too. But let's go to this post office first, real fast. Um. I was going to take the bus up there, but it's going to take too long for me to wait on it. So, I'm going to just walk up there. Oh. So, yeah, let's walk up that dang thing. All right, so we leaving the uh, post office, got the receipt. So I don't know if you watching this, like I said, but if you are watching this, shout out to you, your piece is on the way to you. Um, I'm gonna find somewhere to sit down because I want to talk to y'all about like the New York stuff. I told y'all I want to talk to y'all. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna find somewhere for me to like sit down and like talk, wrap y'all up a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Let y'all know what's going on. Whew. All right, y'all. So I'm like ducked off. Let me move this up a little bit more so y'all can be able to like hear me a little bit. But um. I'm like sitting and like the creases real fast, but that's not really, it's not really important, important for real. But I just want to talk to y'all, you know what I'm saying? Uh, that's my daily errands, you know what I'm saying? Whenever somebody like buy stuff from me, man, I really need a haircut, my beard looks so nappy. Oh my goodness, bro, look at me, I look terrible. I need a haircut, I probably will get a haircut tomorrow. But look, so that's typically like what I do when people like buy stuff from me, uh, I get it out my closet. Um, I got to go to the library so I can go print out the shipping label and then I walk a long walk, hot walk when it's hot outside to the library. I print out the shipping label then I go to the post office which is like up the street. Another long hot walk. I walk up there and then I ship the pieces. So I just want to give y'all like, you know what I'm saying, show y'all how like that whole process is. But um, yeah, about the New York thing. So. Like I told y'all, before I left out the library, I filled out a few applications in New York because, of course, like, I'm gonna need a job to, like, hold me up. I don't know how, like, the me, like, making stuff and selling stuff is gonna work. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? That's not really, like, a consistent income. Like, people just buy here and there, but, like, I gotta fill out job applications. So, think about that. Like, what the fuck? Like, the thing about that is, like, bruh, I'm nervous as I don't know what to like move back to New York because I literally don't know what I'm doing, bro. Like, I don't know what jobs are gonna hire me this time. Last time I was there, I was working at Buffalo Exchange and I had to leave like, you know what I'm saying, as soon as possible so I wasn't able to give them my um, my two week notice. Cause normally you're supposed to give like a two week notice so you can end on good note. But I wasn't able to give them a two week notice. I had to leave like the same day I called them. so. They told me that I wasn't like, based on the like, you know what I'm saying, based on the guidelines and stuff like that, I'm not able to like come back. I don't know how long until I can come back, I'm gonna call them and ask, but yeah. So Buffalo Exchange is out the window. So I applied to like um, a Beacon's Closet, that's another um, thrift store. I applied to Dr. Martin, uh, like the shoe joint. And I applied to, uh, I applied to another place. And then the other places that I had on my list, I got to call them because they didn't have anything on the, like, website. So, I really don't know what I'm doing, y'all. Like, I don't know where I'm going to be staying at. I don't know, like, how I'm about to do none of this stuff. Like, I'm low-key. Like, low-key, I didn't want to, like, come to these turns. But 
I might low key end up having to like lay on a bench like this for a couple days or something out in New York. Like it sounds crazy, it sounds like funny, like I'm trying to be funny or something like that, but like I never know I might have to because like I'm willing to just, you know what I'm saying, do what I gotta do, but I'm low key not trying to sleep outside, but um yeah, like I really just want to get to New York and make this music. Like if y'all don't know, I finished the intro to cause I make it like an EP and I'ma drop a few songs before that. But yeah, like I'm making an EP and I would like drop a few more songs before the EP come out and stuff like that. So I wrote and like just voice memo the intro to my EP last night. So I feel real good about that. And like the modeling stuff, I still haven't got a call back from uh, Pierre Moss. So I don't know how that's going to go. I don't know what I'm going to do when I get to New York. Am I going to go to like, like casting agencies or just different casting calls? I low key, like high key don't know what I'm doing y'all like. I'm all over the place and I've always been all over the place. But the thing is, like, I'm nervous, but I'm not nervous at the same time because I know I'm going to figure something out. But I'm nervous at the same time because I just don't know what's going to happen at all. And I'm sorry, y'all. I need to brush my facial hair because my facial hair just look a mess right now, bro. Like, where's my brush at, bro? Like, I keep looking at it. Y'all see that, bro? This the only side that's just not really connecting, like, you know what I'm saying? That's so terrible. Like, come on, bruh. This the only thing that be making me not like my facial. I be want to cut this stuff off, bruh. But yeah, like I was saying, I, I just got to move to New York because it's filled with so many creative, so many people I can network with and stuff like that. And you know what I'm saying? So many people who make music out there, so many people who model, who make clothes. Like, I have to go out there and just network. So. Like I told y'all, I'm confident in my abilities to try to figure stuff out and find stuff out, but I'm still nervous because I don't know what's going on at all, y'all. Like, this is my last week of work, so once I get this last paycheck, I'm going down there with whatever money I have, and it's nowhere near the amount of money I had last time, like I told y'all last video. I'm just like, whew, I'm all over the place, y'all. Like, oh my goodness. I really don't know what I'm doing. Oh my, I don't though, like, I've been battling like these couple days, the closer and closer it is to like, I don't have to work no more, it's like, oh my goodness, because I said I was going to move to New York like next week, like after this week over, the Monday coming up, like next Monday I was going to move to New York, but I don't know if I'm going to move that early, I'm going to try to see what I can do while I'm here for right now, and try to like, make some moves and then figure it out once I get out there. I low key don't want to move out there until I actually have a job, like a job calls me back or like I go up there for a day or two and go to the stores and talk to the managers and stuff like that. But I really don't know what I'm doing, y'all. I really don't. Like I'm glad y'all, you know what I'm saying? Last video, y'all showed me all y'all support and stuff like that. I really appreciate it. Y'all said just make whatever videos I want to make and stuff like that. So that made me feel real good that y'all still supporting and y'all gonna still watch it and stuff like that because I look keep be feeling like these videos y'all don't like this stuff like you know what I'm saying like I told y'all I want to turn this whole like my whole YouTube and just a life into a lifestyle um you know what I'm saying a lifestyle show kind of so y'all can just see all the stuff so I'm gonna be going to like different restaurants trying different foods doing challenges with my friends stuff like that but other than that I need to figure out what I'm doing in New York and that's just like really throwing me off right now because I really don't know but this is life, bro. Like, this really is life. Like, <laughs> this is life. You got, like, goals and dreams that you want to do. And it's like, you don't know how you're going to do it, but you just know. Like, have you ever had, like, this gut feeling where you know it's going to work, but you don't know how it's going to work? But you know for certain, like, so 100%, almost 100% that this is going to work, but you don't know how it's going to work. That's where I'm at right now. Oh no, yeah. Oh my goodness. Mm. My mind is all over the place, bro. Like my mind is all over the place. I got real bad anxiety. Like, tch. oh no, y'all. I'm really be tweaking. Like my hair. Look at that. My hair a mess. I need a haircut. Oh goodness. I should have had my hat off the whole time. A low key, you know what I'm saying. I've been falling in love with my hair lately. My hair be looking real good. You know what I'm saying? It's getting real lengthy, real long. You know what I'm saying? I'm glowing. 
See, it don't look that bad now that I don't got a hat on. Like, my not having a haircut looks a lot more better, but. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see, I told y'all I be wearing this shirt all the time, but who cares? So what, guys? I'm about to be in New York with no place to live and stuff like that, so I'm going to be trying to, you know what I'm saying, go take baths to certain places and stuff like that. Um, So hopefully, like, a friend, some I, my friend out there, let me know what I'm saying. If I had to, hopefully my friend be like, hey, can I uh, take a shower in your crib, you know what I'm saying? Because that, that's where I'm at at this point. Like, I'm at the point of where I'm just ready to just go all in on nothing, bro. It's just like, what, the worst that could happen is I got to come back home. That's the worst that could happen. So like, the worst that could happen is like last time, I just came home and start all over again. That's like the worst that could happen, y'all. But I'm not trying to have to come back home. That's the thing, I'm not trying to come back home. Once I leave this time, I'm not trying to come back unless I'm just visiting friends or something. So, you know what I'm saying. Uh, I don't know, y'all. I'm low key, like, so anxious. I need to, I want to know so bad if Pierre Moss pick me or not. Like, I really want to know if they pick me or not. Like, at first, I was just like, ah, I guess they didn't pick me, but they've been posting stuff lately, and they said that they didn't send out emails for the castings and stuff like that. They saw over 600 people, so. And the the um, fashion show is on Sunday, so and it's Tuesday right now, so I don't know how this go, gonna go. I don't know, y'all. Like, oh my God! Anybody watching this that's like younger and hasn't gotten to this like adult stage yet, take your time. You know what I'm saying? Take your time because once you get, you know what I'm saying, in your twenties and all that stuff, trying to have to figure stuff out, it get it get real tricky, buddy. But yeah, uh, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk to y'all about. Um, I wasn't doing anything exciting. I'm about to uh, just go edit this video and go in the crib. I'm really not doing anything else today. I just wanted to, you know what I'm saying, bring y'all with me and show y'all how the process of me uh, when somebody buys stuff from me and talk to y'all about this New York stuff. I'm probably going to be talking to y'all about this New York stuff for every, almost every video <laughs> because I just be needing an event, y'all. I really do. But... Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm about to go to the library, edit this video, and then I'm going to go home. Um, I just want to thank y'all for watching, and thank y'all for keep supporting me. Uh, I'm going to make more exciting videos, I promise y'all. Just bear with me. It's going to be like more like me doing stuff. I might do like a thrift challenge with my friends soon. Uh, I'm definitely, I might do that before I, you know what I'm saying, figure out like actually leave to New York. I'm definitely gonna do that with my friends. I'm gonna do a couple of those. So stay tuned to that too, cause I, I don't wanna just keep giving y'all ranting videos, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna give y'all some exciting stuff. So stay tuned to those for real, for real. And yeah, I'll see y'all next video. It's your boy Forge Repetent. Pray for me, you know what I'm saying? Please, anybody out there pray for me. And thank you for supporting. And I'll see y'all next video. And we are out. You did!